I think this co-op has helped me mature a lot as a person. You know, my day-to-day -day interactions are much more professional. My communication skills are stronger. I think I'm really fortunate in the fact that I get to work with technicians and clinicians that have 10, 20, even 30 years of experience in the field. I get to come in, shadow them, work with them, and kind of pick up these little tricks of the trade along the way. You know, how to interact with a patient, how to make a device in the best way possible, and how to really assess someone to help them regain their mobility. Losing a limb can be a devastating experience. Some of these people are just so fierce and they keep fighting and they're really working to get their independence back, which is really inspiring. We're getting some like wounded warriors in here, some people that have really fascinating stories and just have a really strong spirit. We had a bilateral amputee who was amputated below both elbows. We're currently making him myoelectric arm devices, which he can control with his muscle signals. I kind of fell in love with this field. You know, I definitely want to be involved in prosthetics. Um, I'm kind of torn between a research-based approach and a clinician-based approach, but um, I highly recommend a co-op. You get used to that workplace environment. It prepares you for the future, prepares you for the job search process, and really gives you a step up in terms of work experience.